Okay, and I'm coming back here briefly just to give you a better idea of, of what I've done so far anyway. This is kind of showing you. We've got three nuts that have been attached and torqued down. Um, not, not to any particular torque, but just enough to where obviously it pulls the rims together. And you can see now that you've got more than enough room to start the rest of your nuts on these bolts here. So I'll go ahead and add uh, each of these nuts onto each of the respective bolts, and then we'll start with our uh, our 60 60 pounds initially. If you don't have a torque wrench, uh, it is something you're going to need to pick up because because these are torque specific. It's something you should be able to pick up in pretty much any Lowe's, Home Depot. Um, so there's a lot of just individual shops as well as you can pick up a torque wrench, and it's got adjustable torque settings on here and. Initially, like I said, we're going to start with 60 pounds all the way around, and then once that's done, then we'll do 80 pounds. So, again, I'm going to go ahead and pause, and uh, I'll resume once I get everything torqued down at least to the 60, so you can kind of get an idea.